Mac is a first for this uh, these two teams here, due to the fact they've been uh, banned, most of them actually. Aurelia has been banned for most of the time. Yeah. Oh, the new Triforce change makes Aurelia pretty strong. So, mm. Uh, mm. yeah. Rek'Sai picked Ooh. up here. Uh, all right, against this Blitzcrank. Necrophilia. We'll avoid Blitzcrank looking people over walls. We'll be able to see with Tremor Sense. Mm. What, do you, uh, what do you reckon the ADC is going to pop off this game, Nathan? Well, there's only one ADC ban, and that's Vayne. So, I mean... Uh, <laughs> Rossmore won't be able to pick up that vein or either Christchurch for that matter. Don't you so just uh, remember losing to that... Uh, Caitlin Ezreal, Twitch, Ash, all still open, really strong ADC picks. Mm. Draven instantly locked him and Heimerdinger. Oh. <laughs> we do love to see a dunger. I do love to see a dunger. Everyone, can we get the, the raise your dongers? Everyone raise your dongers. But no gin, Nathan. No gin jungle this time. I'm happy about the no gin jungle. I, I mean, I want to see a gin jungle again. We didn't get to see the... Uh, the, 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 uh, the can we get a can we get a can we get a razor dog in the nice chat? Banned, so it's pretty interesting that you didn't get banned. But misfortune is picked up again. Really strong to go with uh, mm. this Oriana. Oriana on turn F is uh, pretty strong. Nathan, I just want to see a, a raise your dongers in chat in this wish chat. Eh? The raise your dongers, of course. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out to the megalodon. <laughs> Braum has picked up. Good uh, knife protection for the MF. I mean, yeah, it might actually be picked up yet, Nathan. It's just hovered. Don't get too excited, sir. Man, I'm always getting to see uh, the heart of the Frey Lord. Oh, stand hey. behind Brawl. Yeah. Stand behind Brawl. That was a great song. I like that yeah. song. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and it is picked, Nathan. You were right. But we see Kazakhs being hovered over and immediately locked in here. See, now, based off comp, I am... Very much a fan of the Rossmore team. They're, I, I feel as if they're just the stronger team. Mm. Um, still undefeated currently. Th this game could decide whether or not they're can they go? They're can we go to the uh, tournament, winning uh, quite a quite a good, uh, I good mean, prize here? They could do the MSI SKT here, Nathan, and uh, lose one game in the finals. Be perfect throughout the season. I mean, throughout the whole of MSI. SKT versus Africa freaks feels bad, man. Mm. But uh, Kazakh's very good jungle currently. Um, Rise, strong, late game, un like unbeatable pretty much. Uh, Draven, good, very strong early game. Nice lot of damage. Heimerdinger, going to be interesting to see how it fares against this Aurelia. Should be all right against Aurelia. Um, actually, no, it could be Heimerdinger mid, Rise top. Mm. Don't actually know yet. I mean, I want to see Heimie top. Heimie top would work a bit better than the... Uh, Against the Aurelia, Aurelia's forced to jump in on him. Yeah, they so, might uh, swap lanes. The turret's know. pretty good. Oh. But uh, three-minute delay is uh, a bit of a killer. And uh, we've gone into the... Uh, so both teams opting for that double TP. That'll rotate the man around the map, rather. Mm. Oh, we've got a quick announcement by the big Sully. <laughs> yes, thanks everyone. Um, yeah, so we have some, obviously some Twitch uh, competitions we've said before that we're going to take place. So yeah, we need a tagline for our season 2016 coming up soon. Um, so those people out there, if you are interested in winning yourself a Logitech backpack and Logitech mobile mouse, get involved, like our Facebook page and leave a comment on what you think is the best tagline for season 2016, okay? So that would be going until Wednesday along with our prize Thanks to NBC Universal for providing us uh, some epic uh, tickets to the Warcraft movie. I have seen it myself. I enjoyed it. I guess if you like Warcraft, it's pretty good. Okay, so we got that as well. That'll be stopping on the Wednesday as well. So make sure to get involved, like our Facebook page, and keep in touch, guys, as we take place in the uh, well, as we take over the third game of the finals, grand finals. I do hope that Christchurch can pull up a good last game. But we obviously have some uh, def oh, uh, pressure from the Rossmore team. We clearly seem to be extremely good. It's not <laughs> I'll give it back to you guys, commentators. Oh, they subbed him. Uh, who subbed out? Who uh, was Chain it? Warden Chain Warden. Warden that's it. Caffeine overdose taking yeah. taking over. Yeah. But so their mid laner was forced to go support. He was somewhat okay. You know, Fat Cat did come out, and it's probably his bedtime, but... <laughs> yeah. It's everyone's material. <laughs> 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 I don't see no copyright sign. <laughs> so both teams are really just kind of one of the looking to... Uh, oh, well. Christchurch looking to team fight. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to say both teams are looking to team fight, and I looked at the bloody Rossmore team, and it's just not going to happen. 
Yeah, Rossmore's looking for the picks, whilst uh, Christchurch is looking to team fight. So Rossmore's kind of just need to make sure the ward up and yeah. <laughs> With Kazix and the bloody. <laughs> yeah, dude, I'm ready for the Donga to pop off, Nathan. If I don't see him go 16 0, I'll be very upset. I mean, I'm always up to see uh, a Donga. <laughs> so that's, <laughs> that's a sentence I never thought I'd say. <laughs> 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 Yeah. You heard it here, Twitch chat. Go for it. Go, go, go. Spam Kappa Pride. Kappa Pride, boys. Kappa Pride. Always love seeing dungers. Let's go. Nathan Jackson, 20, 2016. Put that on his yearbook, quiet. Yearbook? I got a yearbook? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Graduate. Who gives me a yearbook? The government? Yeah, put it back in the, uh, put it back in the Tramby yearbook, eh? Go yeah, back. Yeah. <laughs> just a random picture of myself just in the Tramby yearbook for the current year 12. Just yeah. like, I love a bit I of dog like seeing <laughs> dongers. <laughs> the classic. Now, as we do get into the loading screen here, Nathan, we will see if skins do get wins indeed. Ross Morn has been uh, <laughs> on the, uh, the skin get wins hype train. Of course. Oh, we've got it trending. Hashtag Megalodon. Slight uh, technical issue here. Uh, so I'm letting, dropping the ball. Yeah, he's not paying attention then. <laughs> Clearly a chimp. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at that triumph for Rise skin right there. Then. Oh, triumph at Rise. He's been in the uh, tournament before. Skins do get wins, Nathan, and we will see. It's actually the first time I've seen the skin. I mean, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Mecha Kazix. You can see Mecha Kazix in So they do have the foreskin for the, uh, <laughs> for the Rossmore side. It's too many. First it's raise your dongers and now it's foreskin. <laughs> yeah. Where? What are you looking? Oh, he's looking at Rex Eye. Oh. oh. It's actually a shoe. Hold it. Rex Eye looks like it's pulling itself, just holding it up with his arms, and it actually uses his back. That's an upper body strength right there. You just type it up. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, Megalodons are huge. They. <laughs> they were. They were. They were. Oh, missed pull from the Blitzcrank here. If Megalodon's on our top, we'd all be dead. <laughs> anyway, we're kind of ignoring the fact of this font. It's like a bus. <laughs> <laughs> Just imagine a bus running at you. Or running at you. We've it's distracted. Yeah. We've distracted ourselves. We've gone through tea talk, Nathan. Gone through curry lemons. And now we're going to Megalodon's. <laughs> Word of advice for the uh, the rough streets. Don't allow yourself to be called a megalodon. Yep. <laughs> it's rough out there. Especially shout in the Bald Shout street. out to the, the mean streets the of the Bald Ivers. The tree uh, <laughs> scooter rats. Uh, Going to look like it's just a fairly standard start here for the game. Mm. Uh, Kazakh's really kind of wants to be focusing this Rise to get him rolling. Just Once Rise gets rolling, he's going to snowball really hard and just going to be huge. I just want to see all the kills from all the every single scene. Just go to this goddamn home and and anything. I'm ready to raise the dongle. Hold on. Draven's mid. Rise and Blitzcrank are in the jungle. They're, they're looking for some cheese players. I'm they very much interested in what's happening down there once the camera goes to see hello. It looks like they're taking red buff over there. Let's oh, just look sort at of this. pan over. I really is going to have a bit Can't of a tough time better. here in the mid lane. See. I can't even change the thing. Yeah, I'm not sure what's happening uh, <laughs> in the, the red side jungle, but uh, I can't actually... There we go. Rise of Blitz. Just looking for a bit of a cheese fest here. Yeah. Well, here we go. Very confused what's happening. Oh, missed pull here from this Blitzcrank. Maybe Raven? slowing out to get Chain Warden was such a good idea. <laughs> oh. Look like the option put the support with the AEP carry. I'm so confused. <laughs> Which is interesting. Oh my lord, these boosted pulls, Nathan. But uh, Christchurch do get that level 2 first, so we'll get the main advantage. Mm. Oh, Kazix is getting quite low to this. Uh, it's going to be interesting to see how this new sub 
does fair. Really, uh, I mean, don't think I've seen him play yet. If he's any indication right now, he's just missed two pulls on quite open targets. Hey. He missed two pulls. I mean. Served the jungle, Jesse. Oh, did they? Yeah. I thought Chain was. Oh, okay, fair enough. Yeah, they're mid laner is the support. Oh, alright. Maybe they should have put him on support. So, uh, yeah, they moved the Orion out top lane. Aurelia mid. Yeah, okay. Hey, Kappa Pride. Hey, get those Kappa Pride. Show me your dongers. <laughs> <laughs> Classic Nathan. He's Nathan's popped up with his uh, donger and his foreskin. By the sounds of it. <laughs> That's not what we said. <laughs> <laughs> well, you did say that, Nathan. Oh, oh, nice, nice wall on the misfortune. Nice wall there, but from blocking all the damage. Is Fortune taking a lot of damage from this mm. I'm not totally sure what the damage is. Oh, Rise is second. going to go down here, maybe. Nice flash oh, there. Oh, nice. Second kill for first blood. Nice goal. That has to be flash. Oh, Draven's going to die here. Oh, here we go. A nice heal. A nice heal. A nice heal. I'm really unsure how about this... Uh, Pairing up this rise with the uh, the blitz mm. Kazix is coming in for those uh, not really clean up kills, but like Draven should really be paired, paired up with Draven. Um, with Crank. Yeah, for be sure. Able to pull him in, just get heaps of water attacks on. Like Draven versus MF, like he wins pretty mm. much convincingly. Like Misfortune just won't be able to do anything. Mm. Oh, here we go. The gank's coming in. Oh, hang on, he's turned around here, wants a fight. Ooh, oh, nice. Oh, nice. Good pick up kill here. Rex oh, up. huge damage coming out. Kazakh is here, flashes over the wall. Raven Flash is lucky fight. to live. He has the wall or two, he can life steal back up. Very I mean, nice play there by the, uh, the Ross Moore and Tom team. Tom, Tom. Ross Moore, Tom. Classic Nathan's live up here, let's see. Oh, here we go. TP is coming in here. Rex Star was pretty, pretty ballsy though. Oh, if he's not careful, he's gonna go down. Draven. Oh my lord, overstay. Just a classic overstay here from this Draven. <laughs> Don't worry, I'm ready. Uh, ready to see the Dong in action there. The oh, I think he's got a quite a uh, decent. Uh, I was gonna say CS Logan, but he's not versing Aurelia. This fortune does have a bit of a CS lead against this rise day. Mm. So, uh, As expected. Yeah. Uh, rise is not very good early on. Draven probably poked out. They'd finally do switch up the mid laner to go to mid lane. <laughs> has the, really Back to the, 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 stan lane. the standard lanes, Nathan. Yeah. of damage coming out with the Hominiger up there. Mm. Really taking out the Aurelia. <laughs> oh, Blitzcrank. Looking for a pull here. Does miss it. And, uh, shame there by Blitzcrank. That could have been an easy that kill for him. That could have been a lot of damage out there. Kazix is here looking to take it. Kazix doesn't take his blue. Their blue, sorry. But uh, we, we saw uh, only one uh, Rico in this game. Yeah, this is true. I'm gonna see one Rico taking the. Oh, here we go, here. Yeah. Huge Draven damage. missed his ult, and that oh was pretty poor play there by Draven. Now, he's gonna be a double kill here for Misfortune. Double kill for this MF here. She is 3 0. Misfortune is pretty scary at this point. He's gonna be doing a lot of damage in these team fights. The Q is gonna be just pretty much crushing the lane for her. So, uh, Ross Moore. Aren't going to be doing a lot at this point mm. in this bot lane. It's 4 1. But the gold lead isn't that significant, Nathan. Well, it's about a K. I mean, it's not that big. Eight minutes in. I mean, I thought it would have been a lot bigger if it's 4 1. A gank is coming in here for pi uh, to pixels. 
It's smaller than the diagram. Smaller than the diagram. <laughs> we out here. What, what are we out here doing, cuz? <laughs> <laughs> We're repping Trambi in it. <laughs> we stop that now. Oh, that was a flash. Yes, uh, we, <laughs> need, we need to be focused on this game, Jesse. I'm prepared. I'm sorry. A nice nice old there, combo there by uh, the Misfortune. Oh my lord. It was jumper. a nice attempt by uh, Draven there mm. to interrupt the yeah. uh, Misfortune ult. But, uh, Sadly, last, didn't get it. He still died. Yep. I mean, she's 4 right? She's just going to yeah, be huge she's this She's good game. in Ghostblade first, so she's going to just be melting this Draven. Mm. Like, she, yeah. Else. Ghostblade into Black Leela. Yeah. It's actually going to be Duskblade as well. Yeah. I yeah. usually get that third item if I was a player, man. Second item, Duskblade. It's really gonna. I think it's gonna be up to this uh, Kazix to really get lives or uh, drive to do anything. A nice old hit from the Ariana. Ariana doing a lot of damage. Picks yeah. up the kill on the Tommy thing. There's a gank mid currently. Braun Aurelia is attacking this Kazix. I mean, a oh, nice, nice damage. Here. This could oh. very nice pick up for Draven. He That's needed that a lot. He had heaps of stacks on him from his uh, yeah. his axes. This and uh, that is pretty big for this Draven. He's going to he get goes, that goal. Yeah, if he goes back now, he's like an, that's an easy Yomu's right there. Yeah. So, uh, but we're just... Uh, there's a look at that top lane there. So he was doing huge damage when Harbinger he came down. Harbinger doesn't actually have TPE here, so he's missing out on a lot of CX. It's crashing from the top. <laughs> <laughs> oh, a nice pull from that Blitzcrank here. Draven could fight this quite comfortably. Huge damage here. Oh, oh nice ult. Ult Just narrowly escaped by the Draven. She put it in the middle, that would have been a dead Draven right there. To raise. Draven just trying to get out of here. I'm ready for it now. What really is down here? Driving does have to be pretty bad. careful here. I'm ready for the boosted pull on this Aurelius. <laughs> this yeah, Draven. They really should just pull him into the turret. Yeah. Oh my lord, here we go. Yeah, it took too long to make that play happen, so it allowed four of them to come down. Oh, here we go. Ryze coming in. It doesn't do damage yet, so otherwise that would have been as well as dead by the way. Oh, a nice Q from the Braum here. It does do a lot of damage. I'm it is walking down. Probably just better staying top and just he's Finally. already lost quite a bit on the... Uh, yeah. Go around him. Sure, huge damage coming from this Price team here. just coming out really big when it really counts too. Mm, Ross Moyne probably not doing the smartest of plays when it comes down yeah, to... They uh, didn't play the champ select well. This mid and doing sw a bit of swapping silly, and stuff. Silly picks. Yeah. Tom, say goodbye to him. <laughs> and that was Tom leaving. He's not going to drive safe, and he's not going to get home in one piece. Wow. That's dark. Confirm it, Twitch chat. Dark. We're out here playing games, Jesse. We don't need your negativity. Right, the perfect yin and yang balance, Nathan. Wow. Anyway, the gold lead is nearly 2k, as I struggle to get that out. Yep. And uh, Hominick is now mid. Mm. Trying to pair up against this Aurelia. But Orion is on her way down. This could be... Hominick is really should be backing up. You could, you could see oh. Aurelia. Oh. It's not a lot of damage. Oh. He's that gone. That is really just He's poor gone. communication by Rossi here. They Ross saw, Ar <laughs> saw Orianna walking down. Through that pink ward in top lane. And just wasn't pinged it. It's like dead. I'm thinking it should back up, but it's a TP bot line. It's pretty poor. Mm, pretty poor I don't TP think here. it's going to get anyone. It's not. wasn't far back. Um, back no, but she did pop out and then uh, <laughs> got about 40 damage after that Kazakh's bow. Yeah. Oh, nice oh, pull nice from this blue That's pretty big. 
But then again, the MFO does come out here and does do huge damage here. here. Oh, my lord. And it's probably going to be dead. Mr. Yes, Mr. that is a dead MF. All three dead. Oh, here we go. Oh, lucky there by the uh, Flip Dragon. That's a double kill to Blitzcrank. Probably not the best target to uh, get those kills on, but uh, nonetheless, it was two kills. Yeah, they lost a lot of bot match for that. Sorry, three, three kills on the bot lane. His fortune dead, so stops her farming. She's already got quite a bit of a lead, so it stops that. And that TP from Aurelia, you know. She's actually building uh, Dust Blade second item, so mm. she's going to have heaps of armor thing. When she TP'd down to that bot lane, she was, she was looking for something, but I feel like she overextended that look and obviously tied for that. Yeah, like the TP was uh, pretty cool. He didn't put him behind anyone. He didn't really get much out of it. He could have just done it without the TP. Yeah. She was trying to get something, but she was trying a bit too hard to get something. A big CS lead for uh, the rally to be picked up. Mm. I'm hitting it once again. Oh, here we go. There is a decent. Might be a C, we'll get to that later. Yep. Uh, Humdinger, getting caught out a bit here. He does a bit of damage, but he does fall down. Yep. Once again, overextended, with no wards or anything to sort of... To sort of... Like, there's just no communication on the rock. Yeah. Like, all these ganks and stuff are all avoidable. I feel like their head but is... Uh, uh, they're getting a bit too big for their own boots, Nathan, and... Uh, I think they're just getting tired. Yeah. Like, constantly communicating it, all the things, information that's needed to be communicated. Maybe the effort. the pick and ban should have been taken a bit more seriously. They're just underestimating this Christchurch team. And a pause does come out, as yeah, expected, yeah, that Blitzcrank from the DC. Blitzcrank. Yeah, nice time. Allowing that fight mid to happen. And as we get into the pause here... Realistically, Aurelia probably should have been banned. Like, Aurelia is really yeah. strong, especially with the Triforce I mean, changes. Ross Moyen went for those troll picks and uh, obviously didn't pay off. Uh, yeah, we had the... Uh, I don't think it was a troll pick. I think the only Amazing. out of meta one, like really weird one, would be Heimerdinger. No, the uh, bands. I'm talking about the bands. Yeah, but then it the didn't <laughs> impact much. No, but it was troll bands. Like <laughs> Aatrox. Uh, uh, Rise is maybe overstepping his. Uh, yeah, once again, just no wards on their team, just causing them to just die over the map. Right in the center here. For this Rossmoyne team, they're just, just dying. The lack of vision control. They're still in the game, though. They only K got down and gold. So they're still in a pretty good spot to set. They just need to reclaim the vision control. Like, get back their jungle. Like, uh, mm. Huge damage. Rexa. Big damage there. Oh, nice double kill easy here. double kill for this man. And that's a turret. That's first turret of the game. Gone to this. Sorry, not first turret. But that's first turret for Christchurch here. So that's a nice gold jump there by uh, right Christchurch. Increasing that gold lead to nearly 3k. So it went from 1k to 3k in like a matter of seconds. Easy With that double kill and the, uh, the turret in the top lane. I mean, there's a lot of fights going down across the map just due to the fact that Rossmoyne just don't have the vision control here. Yeah, Rossmoyne just need to get farm onto this rise. Yep. Make sure this Kha'Zix doesn't fall too far behind. And farm, farm on the Draven as well. And just get that Draven rolling. He's only 3 and 5. I would expect that they're a bit more to score. <laughs> this spam on the Heimlinger is possibly one of the best in the game. Yep. Because you can spam it all the So, uh, But once again, he's, he's over like push. He's Blitzcrank's coming in here. But he's gonna might Oh just live and that's a double kill here for Ooh, Ooh. nearly, nearly. They get, they do just trade, but Rex mm. once again down here. I'm not sure why Kazakh hasn't come down there. That would have been an easy kill for Blitz that. He was taking He actually down. walked past the uh, the Blitzcrank in the bush. I think he went back to the turret. Mm. Ooh, snipe here from Draven. Doesn't pick up the kill on the man. Mm. Ryze has gone top lane here. Draven sent back to mid. Jaime just going bot in the last few minutes. Oh, a nice ult from the uh, I was going to say Ryze sure. should win that one. But uh, <laughs> evidently not. Ryze doesn't start doing damage until later on this game. Draven has to devil here. Maybe over Stefan is bound to just a bit. I really have uh, huge damage coming up to this Draven. And that will... 
Rossmore just seemed to be all over the map with no clue of what they're doing. Oh, nice pull from his wheelchair here. Oh, nice one up, nice one up. Oh, down. Are they going to continue to dive? No. Because no. I'm going to take it. Yep. I mean, they are quite low. Rise, Rise TP coming in. Ooh, a good nice stun from the Heimer Ding here. A nice Just pull. Pick up two. Oh, Ooh, a nice flash. Nice escape there by the Aurelia and the Oriana. A good, a good run war here. That was very good for them. They got what they oh, wanted. They've come out. <laughs> but, like... Right, um, Rossmore, they really need to just start placing those walls and start. Oh, a nice dodge from that. Get his wall here. Communicating with him. They're getting killed for like no reason. I mean, then again, it comes down to vision control of this map, and they just don't have it. Like, Christchurch is not even that. Like, they oh, a nice ult here. This was not melting the flank there. A good flank the here. Yeah, yeah. Picking up the kills onto the Humming and Rise. Now it's only this tank left, and pick up all three, and it's going to be just. Just straight down mid. Rossmoyne just overstaying in yeah, that land. What I'm saying is that they have no wards. They're going to actually win if they're safe have to wards. do anything they want. Like they just overextend. They're yeah, looking at it. It's it. currently 21 and 8 now. Like. If you look at the wards in the map, there's one pink ward by Rossmoyne on the map. And yeah. there's only two wards, including the pink ward, down. <laughs> Crosshits have three big wards, two big wards in their jungle. That like, is mid turret gone here. And, and they're stronger, like, they're just able to support. If Christchurch don't, you know, mess up, they will have an easy win to this finish line. Yeah, it's like only 7k lead, but this could be the fight on me. Oh, nice, nice ult. Oh, oh, sorry, I'm Raven. Raven's forced out of the fight. Kazix gets low. I'm thinking it's the only one that's around here. Oh, a nice pull from this blitz break here. Yeah. double kill from. I didn't actually see where she got the double kill. The dust blade did kill the Draven. And uh, she altered the... I'm going walked up and just died. Frostmoor yeah. just really just hung up all the time. Yeah. Not showing the dominance they showed in the previous... Oh, Not at last all. Game. Not at all. Rexai just looking to push the top tower here. Doesn't have the minions for it though. We'll back off and just wait for minions to come up. Red team's turret has been destroyed. Now just looking at the turrets, Nathan. It's currently 5-1. So Christchurch here in Tara's lead. And Blitzcrank, not sure what he's doing here, just overstepping the mark. <laughs> Feels bad, man. <laughs> <laughs> looking for the Baron now, they're thinking it, but they don't have any wards on it, so they do need to get that the ward control back up. Mm. Draven just looking to uh so I force these to flash here to get out of the jungle. As it really should stop this. He doesn't necessarily know who's happening. The fact that he's 0-3 as well, uh probably not good. He doesn't have a lot of damage quite yet. He's got the uh oh, oh there he's getting a bit of <laughs> lag on the uh on the game. Bit of a lag issue there. But we're in the game. That MF is 11 and 2 now. Nearly a 10k gold lead. It's, it's getting close. It's about 9k. Mm. I mean, just looking at this MF. That's a gold lead. Yeah, MF is 11 and 2, Nathan. Like, absolutely huge, especially on an MF. Rothmore do have the wave clear to, to sort of stall the game out a little bit. Yeah. So there is an Oriana on the enemy team that can sort of. The Misfortune and the Oriana can siege pretty well. Oh. And uh, there is another. A bit of a lag issue here. Lag on the, uh, on the spectating. Unfortunately, uh, it's a bit upsetting. Oh, what just happened? <laughs> Turret's just exploded. And the um, has died. <laughs> <laughs> but, um, uh, oh, here we go again. Uh, NBN. Can't fall asleep. <laughs> Build the wall. <laughs> <laughs> nice Oriana oh, here. Pretty much killing. It does kill the home. Yeah. Look at this rise as well. Rise is very low. Oh, Probably that's a double kill. Out of that. She wants that double kill, Ness, and she's hungry for it. And currently, Crash Hurts do have Ross an 18 kill lead. Very close to this. Oh, here we Pretty go. Rough for them there.
They need to get more uh, blue trinkets on their... Uh, mm. I'm yeah. not seeing the uh, dominance that we did in the first or second game. Though, they need to get the more wards out into the jungle and start sort of mm. getting control over these objectives and river. I feel like the problem with uh, Christchurch though is they can't finish the game when they should. Yeah. And that's when Lost One might, you know, come up and pick that up and be like, hey, like they we can't to force Baron here. Yeah. Like, there's no reason why they can't be forcing Baron. And they could easily win it. No Gets them to a choke point with the Oriana ult and their fault, and there's just too much. Yeah. Yeah. They, they get a game. good Oriana ult, and if it's just free to unload that, like, full combo on that ult mm -hmm. there. But do you get the dragon? Not the cloud drake. Third one of the game. Yep. Another air dragon, oh, fire dragon after this one. So, uh, that'll be important to get the team to pick up. Draven getting picked up here. Oh, he really should have just had more than the dragon. there. Bad place to recall him. Especially after they just a dragon bear. Dragon's gonna die here. Oh, huge. The MF is doing tons of damage, Nathan. And, uh, that's not good for this last one. I think need to get back to, uh, Mid now. So I'm thinking it's still it. top. Just shredding this. Yeah, it get the will. An MF ult does come out here. This is more of a zone here. QSS is popped on this Draven. Ooh, that was a lot of damage there by MF. Taking up the uh, dust blow on that Draven. Yeah. Yeah. Getting the really double in here. It's pretty much over for uh, Rossmore here. Yeah. Unless they get some miracle fight and just get the Baron and just come back. It's an absolute miracle now. Yeah, that's a real miracle kiss. Love it. It always freaks me out as he just jumps over. <laughs> just flailing his arms on him. Christchurch yeah. really just need to be looking for the uh, the Baron and this, the last yeah. inhib. They look for a Baron fight and get a good choke off with this Oriana MFO, then this is an easy finish for them. Yeah, so they really choose to be getting the Baron, head top lane, wait for the supers to push in on the bot side. I mean, and if just they yeah. poke out anyone who comes to defend the turret and pretty much wins the game from there. Yeah, I mean, if they do. So if they do even rotate the top and do get a Baron fight, they, know they should win. Yeah, right. they'll do it easily. But there's no reason why they wouldn't win. Yeah, if the second option for that is they can just push it off, and shove it in, just get three inhibs open, open the gates that more. It looks like they are pinging towards the Baron. The Rossmore don't have any wards on it, so here we go. Pretty good. Should be yeah for this Christchurch team here. Yeah, no can contest it. If you just head top now, get that top right. Rotate row. that mid in him. I mean, top in him. He's already down. <coughs> Ooh, easy finish here. That right, uh, Rek'Sai is extremely tanky. A nice MFO here, getting the Draven. Oh, nearly killing Draven. That is going to be the turret going down. Oh, Cappy yeah. Overdose has gonna be the triple DC. Here, and that means that two super minions are I mean, they could probably end the game here. The blue screen is behind them as well, Nathan. Yeah, and they do have the minion way for it. Heimendinger just, just back to send. <laughs> Huge damage from the tower here, Nathan. It's from that Baron buff. Now. Nice win there by Christchurch. It looks Getting like we're on over a game four here. Yeah, he had the upset victory over Rossmore, who have currently been undefeated. Finally putting that pressure onto Rossmore to sort of perform better. Yeah. I mean, they've been trolled in this third game here. They pick the troll bear, picks and bands. And yeah, uh, they really need to start taking it a bit more seriously. Yeah, I mean, uh, they're just underestimating they're his Christchurch. Communication game. kind of fall apart early game. Like, they were just getting killed for no reason. Like, mm. there was heaps of vision for them to see it. Yeah, for sure. They just didn't do anything about it. So, uh, uh, yeah. Anyway. So, uh, close game. Going to mm. be uh, game four. And we'll be back in five minutes. Uh, mm. so yeah. And uh, catch you guys later.
us no pass. Doing it all night, all summer. Doing it the way I wanna. Yeah, I'ma dance my heart out till the dawn. But I won't be done when morning comes. Doing it all night, all summer. Gonna spend it like no other. It was a crush, but I couldn't, couldn't get it up. 